Good afternoon, sports fans. So I was asked by a viewer with the, about the Bionic 120 power pack, how long it would take with my solar panel system that I have to charge this if it was fully drained. In this video, I'm going to go over that. I'm gonna show you step by step what it takes to charge this. So that way, if you're using it for QRP, or if you're just using it for, you know, radio operations when you're camping or on the go, this little pack right here can power um, an FT817, no problem at all, five watts, um, and, and you're kicking from there. I haven't gone any higher than that, because um, I just don't want to make that attempt. But right now, we're going to go over this, and I'm going to bring it in the video and show you, and we'll go from there. Okay guys, this is the Bionimo power pack. Um, as you can see here, 120. Um, I've had it for a while now, and this thing is phenomenal. I've used it um, camping and on the road with my 8, 817, and it does what it needs to get done. Um, let me show you real quick. It's got a full battery right now, um, but to charge this, I'll show you what I use. Let me turn that off. Let me move this down the side here. Okay guys, this is the All Powers uh, Solar Charger, um, and I use that with my Bionino Power Pack. Um, in it, it has six panels at 28 watts that this will do. Okay guys, this is the All Powers Solar Panel that I was telling you about. We're outside now. I'm going to show you how this will charge the Power Pack. Um, Remember, this is 28 watts, so it has six panels. Like I said, you can unfold it. That's how it unfolds. Remember, this is how it was inside. And then it has your little hangers if you want to hang it in the tree. There's your solar panels, right? Remember, I was going to show you what it looks like when it's charging. I don't know if you guys can see that red light there. But it's fully charging, right? Ready to go. So you take your power pack, like so. Take it to your input. And if you guys can see this, it's charging away. And this this will charge it within from all the way down to zero to fully back up within a few hours. The 28 watt panel will uh, fill this back up, just a couple hours. Alrighty, sports fans, remember I was going to tell you how long it took. Um, I've only done it in a few hours. This solar panel, 28, to this power pack, it's only taken me a couple hours. Now, in the manufacturer writing, it says 5 to 10 hours. Uh, that's not the case. Arizona, we get plenty of sun. 28 watts into this, it, it's charging quicker than that. So, that's how long it takes. In this next section here, I'm gonna show the hookup to the uh, 817 and how it works from there. Okay, sports fans, so we're back. I've got the solar panel off to the side, the battery pack here. I have my 817 right here. Um, I'm gonna show you the hookup. When you order the power pack, the Bionic power pack, you, you have the option of getting this cable. So that way you can hook it directly to, uh, from the power pack to your radio and everything's set right there. So I'm gonna show you plugging this in is that simple. That's it, it's all it took. Plug it in from there. You do your negative. You do your positive, set them out of the way. Like so. And I'm just gonna show you. That's it. That's all it takes. This entire system will run for however long you have sunlight. So there you go, guys. This is the Bionu Power Pack. The solar charger and the FT817. This is a great QRP radio uh, here. This is a great power pack to use. Like I said, with the 28 uh, watt solar panel That'll charge this pack within a couple hours. It doesn't take five hours. This does not take five hours. If you have any more questions, if you have any comments, if you need more in depth, let me know in the comments below and I'll get back to you as soon as I can with a video on it. Have a great afternoon, guys. Thanks for watching.